Hey guys, we got a nice card from AJ and Moochie thoroughly enjoyed her, uh, her, uh, what would you call it? <laughs> her trip? <laughs> Moochie had a good time. Oh, now Mittens is interested too. Oh, here he goes. Mittens is getting crazy. Anyway, speaking of Mia's funny sketches, I think AJ had said like he really liked the old lady sketch that Mia did in the parking lot when that, that lady almost hit us. <laughs> <laughs> an adventure. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this parking lot is an adventure with uh, it's not that interesting of a story but oh, oh just please don't hit us. <laughs> We're not gonna get out of this parking lot without a dent I, I, are I we? I think she just hit something. <laughs> I think she, did you? <laughs> did you hear the boom? Yeah. I, she hit something. I think there's a reason oh, they have all these poles here. <laughs> huh? Mia needs to draw the lady that almost hit us before she forgets. I think 95 years old would be a low estimate, would you say? Yeah. Oh, she drove this big giant boat of a car. <laughs> and she had these teeth going on. <laughs> <laughs> I love your laugh. It's so cute. <laughs> Yes, that is her. <laughs> so when we were sending out the comics to our patrons, Mia included the sketch from uh, from that parking lot when we were in New Jersey. Uh, so AJ sent us a nice card and coffee and chocolate. This, whatever this is, smells very good. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Thanks, AJ. For the Zio set, I'm not really so much looking for advice, I just have to keep playing with it until I get it the way that works best for me. Like, all the really obvious things are of course what I try first, and then I, I do the more complicated stuff. See how I've got this space here? If we ever can get the basement finished and have shelves, like, actually built, these are just Ikea shelves, like, someday, and since the floor is uneven, you can see that these don't line up, so, anyway. These are temporary. I hope to someday be able to have shelves that are you know, they go up higher, they're a little bit deeper. Um, like, the main problem I'm having is there just physically isn't room. So, like, no, I don't want to put the monsters behind here. I want to be able to see them. This would actually be a cool layout. Have this, have the other rangers on top. You could have the bikes going across the back, kind of like I have here. And then the monsters on either side. The problem is, again, that the five-inch rangers, there's not enough room for them to stand up. Which is a shame, because I like that. And then I could have this up higher, but if the shelf was higher, then I could do it. I could do a couple, I have a couple different options that I could do. With the Ikea shelves, this is not adjustable. So I, I can move this one up and down, but you know, look at what I have for Time Force already. And then, you know, so I, I'm stuck with it this way for the most part. I've got my thinner pink foam, so you know, it'll be good enough. I would like for this to be higher. I think in the show it roughly comes up to about here. Um, I'm also trying to decide if I can live with myself <laughs> in this order. I mean, no matter what I do, it's going to bother me because yellow and I swapped yellow and pink, and I do think this looks better. But this is the turbo order, and that's the shelf right next door. You see the problem I'm having here. Oh, while I'm down here, before I forget. I think somebody was interested in the red vector cycle. Urgh. Anybody interested in the bikes at all? I mean, like, I'm all for doing retro reviews, but man, people don't watch those videos. Not sure what to do with older stuff, but anyway. So that, that is the red vector cycle. This lifts up and... Ah! It shot me! It is a shame all these years later, with all the new technology and everything being more advanced, how backwards toys have kind of gone, at least at, at certain prices. Like, what were these? Like $9.99 or $10, 12 Does anybody remember what these were? Actually, I could probably go look it up. Ugh. Any chance there are prices? Oh. No, it doesn't give the price. I can find it. I have it somewhere. But, I mean, they, these were, like, roughly in the $10 range, I think. Digimon. Ooh. 
Mia's actually looking at it right now. Jerry found a thing on the sidewalk today. I guess it's a mouse. It doesn't look like a mouse to me. Maybe it is. Yeah, maybe it's a mouse. I don't know. I was like, hey, move out of the way. That's not a good spot. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to stay here. You really wanted to get stepped on, I guess. So then I took two sticks, brought the sticks together <laughs> next to it until it was standing on, on each of the sticks. And I lifted it up and just put it over on the grass <laughs> so that it wouldn't get stepped on. You saved the mouse thing. Well, if it doesn't learn to run away, it's going to get eaten. But at least it won't be stepped on. <laughs> Which one is worse? Depends. Put your answers in the comments. <laughs> would, would you rather be stepped on or eaten? Yeah, there you go. That's tonight's trivia. <laughs> the question of the night. It's been a busy day for Moochie, thanks to AJ. <laughs> Trying to get Moochie stoned. <laughs> Oh, Moochie. Yeah, Moochie had a good time. Moochie's hung over there. <laughs> <laughs> I moved it onto the grass. It's like, okay, I guess this is my spot now. <laughs> I just stayed there. What'd you find, Mia? I found a berry crumble recipe that I want to make. I approve of berry crumble. <laughs> <laughs> I think we have everything I would need for this. Really? I'd have to modify it. Okay, but we could have berry crumble now? Not right now. Well, I mean, like tomorrow? Mm. All right, it's getting late. Mia and I watched Bed Knobs and Broomsticks, I don't know how many weeks ago now, and it was too late to watch the bonus features. <laughs> we wanted to see them, and we wanted to see them ever since, and we just, just been busy, so maybe we'll do that now. It's, what time is it? I don't have a clock here anymore. I think it's 10.30. Gonna end here. Thank you guys for watching, and good night. <laughs>